Mr. Falk, you can your report that you have been defamed, directly putting an issue before this council the truth of the charges that you are a terrorist apologist, an anti-Semite, and a hate monger. So it behooves us to consider the accuracy of those allegations, as you demand. In your report, you defend Ahmed Jabari. He's the Hamas military leader and mastermind of the kidnap and detention of Israeli soldier Gilad Shalit who was held incommunicado and denied visits by the Red Cross for over five years in gross violation of international law. Why? Because the kidnapper kept his victim in what you call good health. Terrorist apologist, check. As recently as June 7th, you published an article in which you said, and I quote, that Israel controls the world media. Anti-Semite, check. In your report and press release on June 6th, you argue against Palestinians and Israelis sitting down together and directly negotiating peaceful coexistence now. You said in April in Lebanon that the two-state solution today is obsolete. Hate monger. Check. You repeatedly rationalize what you call resistance. Before Iranian press TV on April 26th, you praised Palestinian resistance as the only means forward. In fact, you said we should expect violent resistance as a response to America's alleged fantasies of global domination. Apologists for violence, check. But in your defense, you were chosen by this council and have been kept in your job for five years precisely because you are an anti-Semitic terrorist apologist hate monger. The credibility problem goes way beyond you.